Well, new tonight, we know that things like our cell phones and our keys are just packed with germs. Our hands are always all over them. Well, in the age of COVID-19, folks are turning to UV sanitizers to try and keep all of their items clean. But the million dollar question is, do they really work? William Pitt reports. What if you could disinfect something at home in minutes? That's what this thing is supposed to do. It's an ultraviolet light box, and it claims to kill 99% of all that stuff. We're putting it to the test with the filth finder. The 12 News filth finder works by counting the amount of living things on a surface. Under 30 means it's pretty clean. A score of 30 means it's dirty, and it can make you sick. Everything from the cold and flu to stomach problems. All right, first, we're going to test my work phone, and frankly, I don't know when the last time this was cleaned. It's uh, two years old and probably when it was made. I'm not optimistic about how this will turn out. 2.55, now let's see what happens when we throw it in the UV sanitizer. We pick this sanitizer up for about 30 bucks. It uses UV lamps to damage the DNA in bacteria and viruses. Came with aromatherapy. It claims to disinfect anything you can fit in there. Phone, keys, even your face mask. Okay, the sanitizer just went off. This thing came in at 39. That's a huge difference. Remember, 30 is dirty, but from 255 to 39 is pretty good. Physician Dr. Andrew Carroll uses UV sanitizers in his office to disinfect the laptops they use. At lunchtime, we'll run it through the machine, and then uh, after the end of the day, we'll run it through it again. His is way more expensive, probably more powerful. He is a doctor, after all, but the principle is the same. Those little nooks and crannies, the crevices between the keys, the UVC light can get in there. This is my wife's phone. Between six-year-old grubby fingers all over it every day and just everyday wear and tear, I don't know that this has ever been cleaned either. Yeah, that's not good. 944. The phone goes in the sanitizer. 10 minutes later, from more than 900 all the way down to 134. So not perfect, but for 30 bucks, it seems to work. Dr. Carroll says to get things really clean, you can always wipe it down with disinfecting cloths and then put it in the box to finish it off. William Pitts, 12 News.